Hello ladies and welcome to today's Behind the Seams. Today I am here to style up this beautiful Zacken and Plover collection, which is the Wild Collection. All right, ladies, here I am. I am fortunate enough to have gotten the Wild Collection from Lucia. I know she would rock it just as good, but here I am. So there is two cardigan colors. I am wearing the black with gray. How chic is this and cool. Like look at these sleeves here, these details with these pops of color. That is what we love about Zacket and Plover. It's a very big collection, but we just dialed it in this year and picked out our favorite favorites and we find this wild collection very classy and beautiful. You know, we don't love too many prints, animal prints, but there's a certain classiness to the right animal print, and this is definitely it. So I've paired this Cardi up with, I have our Lucian Bean Scoop Top, ladies, which we have in black in a few colors. This is a size medium, and I'm wearing it with our pencil skirt, which I have in a size small. I feel like a little stuffed sausage in this, but it's, I feel like it looks great. And especially with the Cardi over, I feel covered and comfortable and it's a great little outfit. Into the fall, I would definitely wear leggings under my pencil skirt and then your legs are covered, but I just wanted to show you this look because we are still in summer season here and transitioning into fall shortly. Look at this cardigan though. I just wanna show the flow of it. This is a size small and we have up to a size extra large. And this is the other beautiful tone color that we have. Absolutely gorgeous. I'll show you this with my jeans, my blue jeans a great look as well and I'm going to style up these cuties for you but before I do we love to let you know about what we do on our personal time uh, I took Ruby and her friend to the beach the other day at my brother Josh and Betsy's him and his wife have a place in Crystal Beach as you know and we went for the day and on our way home we stopped at crumb cookie so if you don't know ladies crumb cookie is I think it's an American company Kristen yeah and the first time I had it was when we were in New York City when we, we drove to New York Ruby and Elle were adamant to stop at a crumb cookie it's a bit of a thing on TikTok. they sit in their car and they review the cookies so they you get a whole tray of cookies you can get two four or six we picked four and then each person tastes a little bit of the cookie here's a little clip of it we did the review we just got back from the beach we're crystal beach and we had to stop at crumb cookie which is in niagara falls we have ruby's friend anna here so we're going to review these cookies together yes. Oh my God, they're insane. Oh my goodness. They're massive. We they're massive. Four. Okay, what do we want to This is on? the thing, ladies, on TikTok. Everybody reviews these cookies in the car. You have to check it out. We got to put the air on or we're going to melt here. Okay, we're going to try the blueberry one first. So Anna, you go ahead, sweetie. Is it good? It's like it's salty. Is it good? It's, it's like, salty? That's like lemony. Mm. It's like, it's good now. It's meth. Yeah. Oh my God. This one is so boring. I'm more of a chocolatey person. Okay, this one's like oh strawberry. God. It looks like everything's melting. It low key is. We were just in a tornado at Crystal Beach. Mm. We had to get off the beach because it was insane. Oh my God. Is, is that, that strawberry? Is it good? Oh my God, this is what everybody does, ladies. I really like that one actually. Good cage and drive away. It tastes like strawberry shortcake. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then the next one is like insane. Mm. It's a big piece Let of cake. I like. It's like a double high cake. It's called German chocolate cake. All right, ladies, we're digging in. Is really it good? good? I bet you it's good. German chocolate cake. I really like that. This is crazy. Look at that big bite ball. Mm, that's good. And I don't know if I'm going to like this, mm. but I'm not a mint person. That was so good, ladies. You have to come to crumb cookie. <laughs> it's not like you guys are partnering. <laughs> no, I'm not at all. I know it's so funny, but we were in the States. Well, we went when we drove to New York a few months ago. And Ruby and Elle made us stop at Crumb Cookie there, and we did it. But mint chocolate chip is one of my favorite ice creams, so I think it'll be good. Uh, I don't like mint chocolate chips, so we'll see. All right, let's do it. Does it taste like it? The icing. Okay, so then you review the ball. So Ruby, one, one. Which is your favorite from for, from mm. first to last? Strawberry. Best. Belgium. That, and then the um, blueberry last. Blueberry. Is it blueberry lemon or something? Mm, I think so. Blueberry lemon cake. That's so good. Oh yeah, that's my favorite. I should like mint. If I did it, that would be my favorite too. That's my favorite. Mint, and then the German, and then the other two. All right, ladies. Thanks for watching. <laughs> 
Kristen was just mentioning, they have like a cookie cutter that you can cut it so that you're not all eating from it. It's kind of funny, like imagine a couple of years ago with COVID, like you would not be sharing these cookies, but here we are, we're in the car and we're sharing the cookies. But here's a picture of me holding a box of the cookies in crumb cookie. This place is insane. It's so great. There's like, they always have like a dozen staff behind. You can see them all working away. I took a little picture there. You can see they're making cookies and I think they're selling tons of these cookies, but there's so many different flavors. They're very unique. And every Sunday, they change the flavors for Monday morning for the week. So every week you can go and get a new flavor tasting of these cookies. And if you check, if ladies, if you feel like it, if you're on TikTok, but just check and, and do crumb cookie and you'll see like there's so many people that come up and they literally do this sitting there every week to checking, you know, which flavors are what, and then you kind of rate them. So we did that together. It's so fun. It's probably my third time now doing it with Ruby. She loves it and it's fun and they do taste pretty good. But ladies, in the picture of me holding the box, I am wearing to the beach I wore that day, my cut loose cotton linen dress from a few seasons ago. Sleeveless V-neck, A-line, love it. I wore it to the beach, it was perfect and just wanted to put a note of that in there. Okay, I'm gonna change enough of that. I'm gonna change into the sweater and I'll be right back. All right, ladies, here I am back with this cutie patootie sweater. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I love, again, we always talk about this detail with Zakin and Plover, how they bring in these cool colors to complement the sweater. I'm actually loving this color with the jeans. It looks so good, smashing. And then here's the color reversed in this sweater. Here is the other color that is the opposite of the vest. So it has the gray with the black little animal print detail. And this is the blue, loving it too with the denim jeans. Such an easy sweater. That's why we love these Zacket sweaters. They're just very uh, simplistic, but have that little pop of detail. So I'm wearing a size small here. It's got a great crew neck and I put on this Ziska with this blue uh, rope that we have here, the cord. And it, I find it picks it up great with the matching color to the cord and then the white for a pop. And then these pearl earrings, the simplicity of them, I feel like it just kind of all works well together. Joanna Love It Ring, ladies, my favorite, as you know. It's cool, it's fun, and it's easy. These are the yoga jeans, the Rachel Skinnies. I've cuffed them up a few times. They're a bit long on me, but that's no problem. I love that look as well. And these are a size 29 that I have on. So there we go, ladies. That concludes the drop of Zacket and Plover this week. Beautiful sweaters. Take your pick. They're so scrumptious. I really am leaning towards this though and this guy because I'm loving the blue. How am I getting away from my black? It's, I don't know what's happening to me. Something's going on. <laughs> Okay. Anyways, all right, ladies, and I forgot to talk about my jewelry in this, but I wanted to point out the Borrow necklace from the Bliss collection with the black square. It looked stunning. I feel like it really actually complemented this very well. And then the silver earrings too were so cute to uh, go along with it. I hope you have an amazing day and we'll see you next time.